wore out. Everybody, welcome back to the Bluegrass Farmer. Uh, wanted to do a video. I've been wanting to do one for three or four days now, and I've just I've just been busy doing everything, and uh, finally uh, found time today to uh, sit down and uh, make a video. Um, first things first, um, the tribute to Tony Rice video. Um, went places that I was not expecting. It got uh, several reviews. Um, people really seem to have enjoyed that. Um, I'm thrilled that you did. I want to thank the, uh, the subscribers that uh, have subscribed to the channel, the new ones, and you know who you are. And I thank you for that. Uh, I'm honored that you felt that uh, you uh, could enjoy this channel and uh, I appreciate it. And I hope you tell your friends about it too as well. And I want to thank those that uh, commented on the uh, Tony Rice tribute uh, video that uh, their stories that they gave, their memories of uh, Tony, uh, the questions that they asked me. Uh, right now, the channel, um, the Bluegrass Farmer channel, is small enough where I can respond back. So I can, um, uh, if you ask me a question or whatever, I'll uh, respond back to you. So right now the channel's small enough that that can be done. But I just want to say thank you for uh, um, being with me and for the new subscribers and everything. Uh, I've got other things planned this year. I'm hoping that uh, some of the uh, regulations and stipulations due to the coronavirus will ease up a little bit uh, as we get into the Bluegrass Festival season. Uh, I'm planning on being at... Uh, a lot of them this year. I'm not going to mention the ones right now because uh, they're still up in the air as to whether they're going to uh, have one or not. But um, I'll be there at the, a lot of the festivals this year, uh, especially here in the state of Kentucky. So uh, keep uh, on track with that. Uh, what I'm going to do today is uh, give you a video. I got to looking back and um, there's not a flat picking video that I've got. Everything I've got is... Uh, you know, uh, the, the small stuff. And uh, so what I wanted to do today, I'm going to attempt, and it's been a while since I've done this, to uh, do a flat pick uh, on the on the guitar. Today I'm using the, uh, <coughs> excuse me, I'm using the uh, HD28 LSV. Uh, the strings that I'm using are the uh, Tony Rice uh, Monel, M-O-N-E-L uh, strings, the medium gauge. And uh, of course, using the uh, the Elliott Capo, and of course the uh, True Tone pick, flat pick that I use. So, uh, without further ado, uh, let's try to do a little flat picking on Big Mon and see how this turns out. It may be a total disaster, but I'm going to give her the best I got for right now, and uh, we'll go from there. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you. 
Tucson. All right, there you go, folks. A little flat picking tune, uh, big mon for you guys and gals, and I appreciate uh, uh, being able to uh, show that to you here today. I uh, just wanted to showcase the uh, LSV uh, on a little flat picking tune, and I hope you've enjoyed it. No, the sound quality probably wasn't that great, but uh, at least you got to hear a little bit of the uh, the guitar itself. And uh, I apologize, uh, I've haven't practiced, uh, uh, but I gave you what I got, so there you go. Hope you've enjoyed the uh, the video. And again, I want to thank everybody for uh, subscribing again. I know I've said that at the very beginning of the uh, the video, but I just want to just appreciate y'all being with me, and uh, hope the channel continues to grow. And uh, we'll have more videos later on. So with that, we'll let you go with uh, Clarence White tune. Tony Rice uh, played it quite a bit. And uh, it's, uh, I try to do it justice. One entitled, I Am a Pilgrim. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you on the next video.